There was an incident with one of my neighbors and what happened with this neighbor was he came up to me and he said I was walking past and I heard a female whisper in my ear and say Amy now this person has heard me talk about ghost stories before but that's about it they don't know that I have a channel they don't watch my videos or anything like that it, what's really strange about this in my opinion is that there is a, an automatic writing video that i did a while back and at the end of that i showed the results and on those pieces of paper i'll go ahead and i'll include this after you see this there was a writing that said amy a-M-M-I-E twice. It also came through the radio as well. Um, A-M-M-I. Wait a minute. Hold on here. A-M-M-I. A-M-M-I. All right, well, that's very interesting, so I'll leave it. Hi. Can you go near the device with the antenna next to the white candle, please? All it will do is change colors. If you can just make it go to a uh, color, that'd be nice. If you're here with me right now. There we go, thank you. Thank you, I greatly appreciate that. I heard you say okay. Is there a spirit named Amy here? Yes? Okay, uh, can Amy tell me how old she is, please? Yeah, you, yeah, you can say it. Is Amy here with us right now? I think I heard a yeah. 
Um, I'm not sure if that was to me. If you, if Amy's here with us right now, can she come toward the antenna? Just like you did before. Did you just say here? Is Amy here with us today? Yes, Amy. I'm thinking that we could try to ask Amy a few questions if that would be okay. I'm hearing like a really light, light ringing in my ears, really high pitched. Okay, um, Amy, how old are you? Can you say how old you are through that radio? Amy, have you always been here? What keeps you here? Why are you in this place? I'm just curious. All right. Let's see. That's a Halloween decoration. I, uh, I haven't been in this place for a while. That's weird. Um, for a long time. All right, I'm going to come back to this room last. Um, later on, because I'm just getting really drawn to this room. Um, this is going to sound really strange, but if you're in here and you're on your phone or something, or, you know, you're just kind of walking around, you kind of notice yourself naturally start to walk towards this room and 
you have the, it's like a pull almost to go back here. And whenever you get back here, it's very intense feeling. I feel um, an extreme amount of uh, like static. Um, I feel like there's something extremely close to me. But um, I just saw like a flash. I think I may have heard it say the F word, like F U, I'm not sure. If there was some type of a light back here, can you please do that again for me, please? That'd be fantastic. What was that? I'm hearing stuff. What the? Excuse me. Uh, I'm hearing stuff. And I just felt my entire body jolt, if that makes sense. Okay, what you're seeing now I believe to be is dust. About right there, I saw this Flash, this flash, so. that's the best way I can describe. Okay. That was, that was very, it was very weird. I've never felt like that. I, I moved and whenever I moved, I felt like I should have stayed there. If that makes sense. Like I, was frozen almost. I don't know. Okay, if you're back there in the kitchen, can you perhaps move that rocking chair? Hello, if you can move that rocking chair, the red one, red wooden one in the kitchen, that would be fantastic. Hi. Pushes up. Something about pushes? I'm not seeing that flash of light again. Right there, you can see where the trash bag kind of hangs down and stops. Right about there. I always see like a pair of legs, like black legs. Um, Two. Um, I've, but it's only in the dark and it's like darker than dark. I don't know, my eyes could just be playing tricks on me, but. Um, it definitely gets intense back there and it calms down whenever you go out of that room. So, so I'm not entirely sure. My goal is to find out what is making that room feel like that.
Can you perhaps tell me why that room feels so intense? Can you tell me what's inside of that room? <laughs> 